What's up, everybody? Ron Blue back again with another video for you guys. We are here with another JT reaction video. I've been getting a lot of comments off of the first one that I did, which was my favorite jug. And that is really, that's like one of my favorite JT songs. Probably, I'm going to say top five JT songs um, from his catalog. Uh, but everybody, for the most part, is saying Infinity Sex is the next one that I should do. Uh, Fire Beats 9204 uh, reacts to react to I'm, I'm assuming yeah, Infinity Sex also imagine uh, to align and of course majority of the album <laughs> okay uh, this is the best album of the year yeah so far I mean we are in March and yeah this is definitely one of those ones that so far the best one out of the year uh 24 D Well says my favorite is Technicolor, but you should check out Effing Up the Dance Floor and Infinity Sex. So the the general idea that I'm getting is pretty much check out this Infinity Sex. So without further ado, we're just gonna jump right into it. Alright, have it pulled up. Alright, let's go. Three, two, one. <laughs> And just like that, I guess we're just jumping directly into it. He just counted us off, counted us off, and now it's just like, wait, we gotta go back because I kind of really wasn't expecting. I was expecting like a little bit more of a build up or, or something, but it's just one, three, uh, three, two, one. Let's get into it. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. <laughs> Yeah, I wanna love you for eternity. Yeah, I just wanna love you for eternity. You know what this actually reminds me of? It, 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 it this truly gives that sexy back vibe. This is. And I know I said it in my favorite drug, and that was the closest thing that I had to it. But this right here, that punchy, doom, 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 doom. Like, literally, it's, it's very close to that vibe. Straight in your face, just like my favorite drug. Um, let's, let's continue. I want to love you for eternity. I just want to love you for eternity. So I really like the effects. I don't know if it's like harmony or if, or if it's the vocoder. Um, you can kind of hear like the lower tones that he's doing. The uh, da, 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 da. He's singing the higher parts and then there's like a da, 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 da. So I don't know if that's like a vocoder or if he's harmonizing, but it, it sounds really amazing. Um, let's continue. Girl, let's go dance. I wanna be your man. Lose control and when you stop moaning, let's take a moment. It's the moment. Okay, let's go then. I don't know you anymore. Soon as all your clothes hit the floor, pray this hotel room is insured. How many times I stop keeping score? I just love that when he goes in the, uh, like you almost, you really don't expect that where he goes, da, da, da. let's go back a little bit just so we can hear it. This hotel room is insured. How many times I stop keeping score? That right there. 
Like you don't like mentally, you're, at least for me, my brain doesn't expect it to go there, but that's what actually makes the song too. If I had to guess, infinity sex girls, future is a mess, but your present is the best. And if I had to guess, infinity sex girls, the future is a mess. Timbaland, I hear the doop -a -doop -a -doop, like his kind of like that Timbaland signature. I definitely hear that. Um, Frederico, uh, he was produced, he was credited on uh, on another song. So look, so this is so this makes so much sense. I didn't catch it this time, the the first time around, um, because I was asking. I'm like, I wonder if James Franco had produced on this. And I couldn't find anything that, you know, I'm like, I'm going through, at least skimming through all the uh, the songs on Genius as I was listening to another song. I think I did it in one of the reaction videos um, of JT's. Um, and I couldn't find, I'm like, oh, well, maybe he's not, maybe he didn't have any writing credit on, uh, on this album. It's so good to hear, to see it, because now I hear it. That I just want to keep this going. That is so, that that arrangement is so James Fauntleroy. I, I can literally hear him playing or like singing a rough draft of that. Um, let's just see here. Oh, you really got a whole team. You got a team of saxo saxophonists, I believe, if that's the right, correct term. Um, flutes. Goodness, this is a... Um, this is a jam pack. Is this the ammo? I think, yeah, this is a shout out to the demo, man. Uh, Damo, I mean, yeah, shout out to Damo. Um, he goes by another name on Instagram, so that's why it, it kind of, his, his actual name is really throwing me off. Man, so this is, this is really, really jam-packed. Um, okay, uh, I think it's damn little great, but let's just double check. Yep. Shout out to, shout out to him, man. That's, that's really dope. Man, so, so that's what... And then, of course, he's associated, if he's not a part of 1500 or nothing, very closely associated with him, with them, with it, which explains, um, you know, the James Farmeroy connection, possibly. Um, this is, this is jam-packed with a lot of people, trumpets, trombone, saxophone, uh, guitars, of course, um, I don't even know what this uh, word is. Flugelhorn, flugelhorn. Um, man, this is this is like I said. This is just super, super jam packed. Uh, really, really dope to see though. Really, really dope to see. Um, man, I, I'm just, I, James. If you see this by chance, I want to hear the uh, the draft of this, like the the skeletons of this. I gotta hear your version of it. Anyway, let's continue. Oh, we still got a decent amount of time left. Okay. Yeah. I 
know the address on your mattress. Just imagine the acrobatics. Woo. Infinity. I'ma hit a hat trick, give me your passion. Ready for action, let's make magic. Oh. Infinity. I'm gonna love you for eternity. To feel I'm on the love you for eternity. This is you definitely here. It's so crazy that you still to this day here, like because of Timberland, you hear the Aaliyah sound. This really gives an Aaliyah at the end vibe to it and just something that you would never expect from the the meat of this song going into this but this is just so that connection that Timbo and Aaliyah had is that is this to fell amour à l'infini ah, why is this so oh my god man see even so that that little minute that we had left to listen to that really just, I, I just wish that we had, you know, a modern day sound for Aaliyah because I think she would sound excellent. Detroit's own as well, but just she would sound so excellent in, in this type of sound in today's time too. Um, man, man, rest in peace to Aaliyah. But uh, back to Justin, man. This was this was what I needed. It's just cherries on top that I actually see James Fontenoy. I see a uh, uh, demo, um, and you could tell by like this orchestra. This is an orchestra. Calvin Harris um, is again a co-producer on this um, on this song. But seeing all these people. This is a ton of people. This orchestra of of live instruments. This this is really really crazy. You could tell that this this was this is like a. It's really weird because I'm trying to figure out how to word what this is, what this particular song is. Um, it should have been a lead single between uh, my favorite drug and this. You can't go wrong with either one. Um, I would take this as a second single, like I said, in My Favorite Drug. I actually do like Selfish, and I understand coming off of Mirrors as his, you know, probably one of his most recent popular songs. It would make sense to just recreate that. Um, again, kind of like, you know, just an updated version of that. That's what I get when I hear that Mirrors. Um... Another thing that I actually like about this song is that it kind of reminds me of, is it Strawberry Bubblegum? Uh, let's see. Uh, strawberry. Yep, Strawberry Bubblegum. Um, so that kind of like, it was such a but like this, of course, Strawberry Bubblegum is a lot more smoother, whereas this one is like do 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 do. But it still has kind of like a similar tempo. Um, that's what it kind of just reminds me of that, and maybe Sexy Back, like a mixture of smooth and sexy back, and that's what I like. That those two together is a more mature JT, and I really really like this. I I really appreciate this. But you guys let me know in the comments what other JT songs should I react to. Um, I'm seeing F and Up the Disco. I'm seeing uh, all right, the dance floor. I don't know why I keep saying disco. Um, uh, maybe it, let's see what it actually is. Uh, no, it is F and Up the Disco. Um, so I keep seeing, you know, just a lot of it. So I'm trying to taper it down. Whatever gets the, the most comments, that's what I try to do next. Uh, but you guys let me know in the comments which one should I do next. If you guys want a guitar lesson to it, drop it in the comments, guys. This is the only channel where you're going to be getting videos like this. Guitar uh, lessons, guitar covers, 
um, boxings and so much more. And shout out to those people that actually recommended this song. This is so dope. It is very, um, it's a, it's very uh, provocative, but it is very textured, very textured, professionally textured. Um, but yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, like, share, subscribe, and until next time, peace.